morning church, uh, Paul Needing here. I'd like to take us on a brief uh, detour from Jesus is this morning and do a Jesus was. And the Bible tells us that Jesus was uh, smitten of God. That famous chapter in Isaiah 53 says, uh, Surely our griefs he himself bore and our sorrows he carried, yet we esteemed him stricken, smitten of God and afflicted. And at the Last Supper Jesus said, it is written, I will smite the shepherd and the sheep will be shattered. That's from Matthew 26, verse 31. Uh, we know it was God's purpose that uh, Jesus would die for our sins and that God planned our sacrifice a long time before the Pharisees did. But how do we see it when Jesus was scourged and crucified? We know it was the Romans that carried out this brutal, brutal punishment and execution. But this text tells us more. It tells us that it was God himself, the Father, who smote Jesus. I believe it's accurate to say that God stirred up his wrath, his jealousy, his righteous anger and his, and his indignation and carried out every blow himself. Every lash of the whip was dealt by his hand. God tore the flesh off his own son. He pushed the mocking crown of thorns onto Jesus' head. His own hand took the hammer to drive the nails through Jesus' hands and his feet and into the cross. The sky darkened and the earth shook in response to the wrath of God. And Jesus, the darling of heaven, was crucified by his own dad. The father exhausted all his wrath against sin upon Jesus in those dreadful hours. And Jesus took it all for us for us his wrath is gone for us forgiveness no punishment awaits us for us restoration salvation healing deliverance for us holiness righteousness and worthiness for us adoption into God's very own family his own sons and daughters for us a rich inheritance awaits beyond our wildest dreams, for us love beyond a measure, all because Jesus was smitten by God himself. The list is endless and the time to savour it is also endless. So please pray with me. Father God, thank you for all that you did to Jesus instead of me. Thank you Jesus for receiving the punishment that should have been mine. Thank you, God, for all the benefits that I will have forever because of this act of love. Help me to fathom the depths of this love, to know it as much as I can. Jesus is my smitten shepherd. May the sorrow and joy of it cut deep into my heart and change me forever. Amen. Thank you, church. God bless your day.